Hello everyone, welcome to Siggy Cooks. A simple lady's finger fry or vendaka puriyal is a tasty and healthy side dish for both rice and roti. I've shared a super simple two-step process which you can prepare in an oven or air fryer. With very minimal effort, you can make non-sticky and crispy lady's finger fry. A completely mess-free way of making this traditional recipe which no one would have told you before. I've taken 500 grams of lady's finger. Choose tender lady's finger for the best taste. Wash them and dry thoroughly with a kitchen tissue. Cut them into medium thick rounds. Spread the cut lady's finger in a white baking tray lined with baking paper or aluminium foil. Add one large tomato roughly chopped. Add one teaspoon chili powder or sambar powder or any masala of your choice. Add two tablespoon oil. Mix evenly and do not add salt at this stage. Bake in a preheated oven at 200 degrees Celsius in fan forced grill mode. While the lady's finger is getting roasted in oven, we can prepare the tempering. Add 2 tablespoon oil in a cooking pan. To the hot oil, add half teaspoon mustard seeds, half teaspoon urad dal, and 2 teaspoon chana dal. Saute well until dal gets slightly roasted. Add 1 red chilli and few curry leaves. Give a quick stir. Add quarter teaspoon hing and give a quick stir. Add one medium sized onion finely chopped. You can add little salt now to avoid dal from getting browned. Saute well until onions turn translucent. After 15 to 20 minutes, the lady's finger should be well roasted. You can adjust the cooking time in oven depending on how crispy or soft you want the lady's finger to be. Take a closer look. The lady's finger is cooked perfectly with very minimal effort. Now you can add the roasted lady's finger to the prepared tempering. You can add required salt now. Mix well. I missed adding turmeric powder earlier, so I am adding now. Saute well in low flame. Add few crushed garlic. Mix well and saute in low flame for one or two more minutes. And your tasty lady's finger fry is ready. Enjoy with rice or roti. And thanks for watching my video so far. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe and I'll see you soon with another interesting recipe. Until then, happy cooking and stay healthy.